Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. To prevent heartburn, take one tablet by mouth with a glass of water 15 to 60 minutes before eating food or drinking beverages that cause heartburn. Do not use more than two tablets in 24 hours unless directed by your doctor. Do not take for more than 14 days in a row without talking with your doctor. Make your mark, take our lead. The FDA reported the famotidine shortage on May 4, 2020. According to the FDA, 20 mg and 40 mg famotidine tablets from manufacturers Orobindo Pharma, Carlsbad Technology, and Teva Pharmaceuticals are in shortage. Take our lead. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration and Health Canada have issued a warning to change the dose and dosing intervals of famotidine in patients with severe or moderate renal failure. Famotidine, a histamine H2 receptor antagonist used mainly to treat peptic ulcer disease, is excreted almost exclusively by the kidneys. Let's help you make your mark. Some affected products include atazanavir, disatinib, dilaverdine, certain azole antifungals, such as itraconazole, ketoconazole, pazopinib, among others. Do not take this medication with other products that contain famotidine or other H2 blockers, cimetidine, nizatidine, ranitidine. Make your mark, take our lead. Check with your doctor right away if you have the following symptoms. Confusion, delirium, hallucinations, disorientation, agitation, seizures, or unusual drowsiness, dullness, tiredness, weakness, or feeling of sluggishness. These are more likely to occur if you are older or if you have a kidney disease. Make your mark, take our lead. Conclusions. Omeprazole is more effective than famotidine for the control of gastroesophageal reflux disease symptoms in H. pylori negative patients, while similar efficacy is observed in H. pylori positive patients with non-erosive gastroesophageal reflux disease. Take our lead. These include prescription strength famotidine, pepsid, and nizatidine. These medications are generally well tolerated but long-term use may be associated with a slight increase in risk of vitamin B12 deficiency and bone fractures. Prescription strength proton pump inhibitors. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.